up guys welcome back once again it is me Malt. so happy to be here with you guys this morning it is 7 53 on a monday morning i know a lot of you guys are probably up playing call of duty um i'm gonna go get that today and post videos on my second channel with that so if you guys don't know what my second channel is it's Molt plays is on the side of my um on my video, if you're looking on YouTube, if you're looking on your computer, um, you can go click on the little three dots and go to channels, and then you'll find it on there. I posted a couple games of Destiny on there. Um, I had a pretty good one that I'm going to be posting later this afternoon. But I'm definitely going to be posting some Call of Duty on there. Um, <clears throat> so head over there and check that out. But today, guys, we've got two Dragon Raids that I'm going to show you guys that got me some pretty good loot. So we've got Max Dragons, Mad Loot, all right? So let's go ahead and watch two of these. Um... We've got this bottom one, 60%, um, and we've got 478 available gold um, and 3,290 Dark Elixir. So we're going to drop off um, these dragons over here and get them centered on this Elixir pump right here. And then we're going to just spam them, head them in there, um, get our rages going because we've got to get those air defenses down. Um, they all went straight to the center, and it looks like they are heading in uh, finally towards that one air defense up top, but that dragon got taken out. We did get out that uh, one air defense towards the bottom. We really need this whole group of dragons to stop messing around with those clan castle troops and take out uh, that air defense, but they're like, no, nah, we're going to head over here to the queen instead and let this air defense keep shooting at us. But they do head in and get a bunch of that dark elixir for me. Um, I just go ahead and drop off my queen right, th my <laughs> queen right there just to get her started. And then um, the dragons are just crushing it in the middle. They're all pretty low health, but we are going to get the town hall. And we're also going to get a lot of the gold. Um, we have one more gold storage in there that's going to be untouched. But we do still have, is that four dragons up? We've still got four dragons up. Our queen is not doing so hot right now. And all of our dragons have pretty low health, especially with all these defenses shooting at them. But... We got 303,000 gold, 157,000 uh, elixir, and almost 3k dark elixir. So I am definitely, definitely happy with that uh, strategy right now. Now, I know this isn't the most uh, elixir-friendly strategy uh, because of the dragons. That's why I don't use it that much. This is just kind of a uh, random thing for you guys. And then here's another one. We didn't get uh, really much dark elixir on this one at all, but we were able to just pretty much troll this guy since he had almost all of his loot inside of his mines and his pumps. Um, so we're just going to drop all those dragons off in the top left to take out those elixir pumps and then we're going to have these dragons go along the top side to get the rest of that gold for us. Um, it is again all in the mines and pumps practically. We do have these storages down here though um, that I don't even know if we end up getting to but you can see our dragons are pretty spread out right now, um, which normally, I don't think that, that really happens. They normally stay together, but that's fine because they are just running around, distracting all the defenses. You can see that this guy is missing uh, his expos. They are all out of uh, all out of juice. They're all out of their elixir. So all we've got left now is these elixir pumps towards the bottom of the base, and we've got one, two, three, four, five, six dragons up this. Dragon right down here just got taken out by that air defense. So we've got to get these dragons together, um, batched up so that they can take out uh, this air defense and the rest of these buildings down here. We do have uh, one dragon down there finally on the elixir pumps, and he is going to have free reign over them until that air defense right there starts shooting at him. But we do have two more. Uh, we do have two more of our dragons up there. We've got our queen coming in as well. Didn't even have to use my king. And queen is going to uh, be out of range right there. But I'm going to go ahead and pop her ability so that we can get the archer tower distracted. Because I don't want the queen to take any damage. So we're going to come in here through the walls. We've still got, looks like, three archers. And um, they oh, it looks like it was four archers. And they are going to get taken out by the archer tower. But the archer tower is going to go down right before it switches to the queen. So we're going to go ahead and take the rest of this loot and call it a day. I know this is a shorter video guys. I'm going to be posting some more later on this afternoon. Um, I'm thinking of coming up with a revenge series for you guys and it might be involving these guys. <laughs> 
and a video that I just posted recently. So we're going to be doing some a new revenge series. It's going to be fun. I've never really done a revenge series at all. Um, so we're going to be doing that, and we're also going to be posting a lot more high-level gameplay from Eliminate. So hope that you guys are ready for that, and I do believe... Oh, would you look at that? Upgrading our fourth or our uh, third mortar to max. Nice. We're going to go ahead and upgrade that. I've been doing... Uh, been doing pretty good rating as you saw that was uh 500,000 gold just in those last two raids but uh yeah that's gonna be it for this episode guys thank you so much for watching i hope y'all are ready for this revenge series it's gonna be hilarious um and hey as always make sure you keep calm and clash on for me right i'll see you guys later peace